Sebastian Mil Martinez, MMA Unit, here with Christoph Jotko, who faces Tool Treng at UFC Fight Night 53 here in Stockholm on Saturday. So, Christoph, your third fight in the UFC, you're one and one now. How do you feel about your third fight? Na razie nie mam problemu z robieniem wagi i na co jestem dobrej myśli. Uh, he feels really good, he feels really confident, the weight cut is going perfectly and uh, he's happy to fight on Saturday. Now, the last time you fought, you you lost for the first time. Some people say that you learn more from a loss than you do from a win. Do you agree? He said, of course, uh, you learn more from a loss than from a win because it makes you think, what, what, did you, uh, what did you do wrong? And from his last fight, he learned to stay cool in the fight and he learned to be patient in the fight because, in his opinion, he was in a hurry in his last fight and that's why he got caught in the guillotine. Now, you lost to a Swede last time. Now you're fighting another Swede who trains with Magnus Edenblad. Do you think maybe you can get some kind of revenge for your loss? I że tamto przegrana z Magnusem to tylko potknięcie. Okay, he said he doesn't see it like this. It's just another opponent and he wants to show with uh, Jan Bochowicz, the other Polish fighter that Polish MMA is bigger than Swedish MMA. So that that's what what he wants to do. Yeah, well I, I just asked your countryman Marcin Bandel about Polish MMA and how big it's getting and now we've got tons of Polish fighters fighting here in Sweden. How far do you think the Polish MMA scene can go? Do you think it can become number one in Europe? Może, może być w Europie jedną z najlepszych z najlepszych krajów, który się tym zajmuje, tak? He said uh, that uh, the sport is growing really fast in Poland. You can see it in the TV almost every day, and a lot of young, talented people get into the sport. And he says that give give our country some time, and we will be number one in Europe for sure. Now, you said you learned patience from your last fight. Your opponent, Tu Treng, he's known as a very patient, very tactical fighter. How do you approach this fight in terms of style? Like I said, Mike Tyson, they win faster. Okay, he says uh, that it's right, it's, uh, he's a confident and he's a tactical fighter, but um, Krzysztof is moving faster. And like Mike Tyson said, the faster fighter will win the fight. Always good signs when you quote Mike Tyson. Uh, so. Tutring is also known as a very good grappler. Would you say that the plan is to keep the fight on the feet? Ale na pewno nie będę nie będę uciekał od parteru, jak i od stojki. Uh, of course he won't tell you the game plan, but he's not afraid to fight with him on the ground and also not in the stand up, so you can expect a good fight. And is there like you said, you can take the fight anywhere, but is there any one area where you think that you're definitely stronger? Jestem mniej doświadczony, ale lepszy w stójce. He thinks that the experience is on Tor's side, but the speed and the striking advantage is on his side. Well, then obviously you've got good things going for you. You've got Mike Tyson on your mind, a good sign. What do you think the fans here in Sweden should expect on Saturday night? Pod krew juzy, tak. Co, co, co? Pod krew juzy. <laughs> Blood and tears. <laughs> All right, well, I guess we'll see which fighter it's coming from on Saturday night. All right, this is Bastian Ben Martinez, MMA Minute, here with Christoph Jotko, who faces Tool Treng, UFC Fight Night Stockholm on Saturday. Jankuji, thank you very much. Thank you.